why doesn't the A10 just hold the trigger and let it rip? I'm an aerospace engineer, and while the GAU-8A cannon on the A10 can fire up to 4,200 rounds per minute, the flight manual makes one thing clear. Short bursts are critical. Firing the gun produces large amounts of hot gas, and this gas can be ingested by the engines, causing disturbances. Sometimes the only sign is a brief drop in fan speed, but if the firing continues, multiple engine disturbances can occur, increasing the risk of a stall or engine over temperature. To reduce that risk, ignition is automatically triggered during gunfire to keep the engines lit. But even with that system active, short bursts prevent hot gas from building up faster than the engines can recover. Also, sustained fire builds heat and puts significant strain on both the gun drive motors and the linkless ammunition feed system. That increases wear, risk of jams, or system failure. But another big reason is ammo. At such high firing rates, up to 4200 rounds per minute, depending on the selected mode, the A-10's magazine can empty fast. So short bursts help pilots conserve ammunition across multiple passes. And they also keep recoil manageable. Each 30 millimeter round delivers a strong kick and firing in short bursts helps the pilot maintain more control of the aircraft and aim precisely. So the you hear is calculated and engineered to protect the engines, preserve the weapon system, and keep the pilot deadly accurate.